Hi, I'm, I'm Peter Kenyon. Welcome to Extra Mile Weight Loss. We have just starting today the next 10-week block to focus our efforts upon our weight loss project. Today's weight loss tip, weight loss tip number 71, is your weight loss is not about a quick fix. Get rich quick schemes don't work and neither do fad diets. We talked about that in the last post. It took years for you to gain your weight. Then you should expect some time to lose it. You must go through a process to achieve a healthy weight. This process may look something like this. It's 10 steps. Step one, realize you must lose weight. Step two, know why you must lose weight. Step three, find someone or, or an organization to help you to lose weight. Step four, take their plan. Step five, be prepared to learn the skills related to that weight loss plan. Step six, be prepared to unlearn your old weight gaining habits. Step seven, know that it will take effort to develop your new skills into new habits. Step eight, be prepared to put that effort into your weight loss. Step nine, accept that once you put the effort in, it will take time. Step 10 is to revisit step two, know why you must lose weight, often because your reason for wanting to lose weight will change as you start achieving results. Now you may falter at any step along this process. So if you haven't lost weight in the past, just go through these 10 steps to see where you faltered. What area do you need to concentrate on to get the results you want? Now some people falter at step number one. They confuse that I wish to lose weight with I must lose weight. It's okay to sit on the fence with, I wish to lose weight. But the feeling that you must lose weight carries much more motivation than a mere wish. If you're sitting with your weight loss group right now, or sometime this week, or you're sweating it out in the gym, then you have found somebody to help you with your lifestyle change. They will be able to feed you the information you need to achieve the results and continue achieving, achieving the results you want. <laughs> now, a lot of us falter at step four, take their plan, because a lot of people, as soon as they be uh, issued with a plan, a plan that's worked for many people in the past, the first thing they want to do is start negotiating with that plan. They want to change it to suit them. You know, you actually don't have that right. You either accept their plan or you don't accept their plan. If, if you don't like their plan, then find another group or person to help you. But if you want to stick with your group or stick with that person, then ask them to help you to learn the skills that relate to making that plan work. And it will take skills, learning skills, which will take effort and it will take time. This is an important concept of this weight loss tip, time and effort. Steps five, six, seven, and eight occur at the same time. We can't simply just drop our old habits. We have to replace habits. If you just drop a habit, what's going to happen is another habit will come into it to fill that space. And it'll probably be a habit that is easy for you to accept, which is another weight gaining habit. What you need to do is learn skills that relate to new habits and then put the effort in to slot that new habit into that space you've created. Remember, you can't just drop old habits. You have to replace habits, so replace them with the habits that are going to give you the results you want. There is a lot relating to this post. So I'm going to recommend that what you do is follow the link back to the website because that's where the, large, the complete transcript of the post is. It's going to be on the website. There's also a short movie for you to watch. It's go for a minute and 30 seconds as a recap of these, the ideas of this post. But go back to the website, read the post. That's weight loss tip number 71. Your weight loss is not a quick fix. Thank you.